Hey, good afternoon and welcome. My name is Sandra. My channel is called Sussex Sandra and welcome. How are we all doing? Are we all doing all right on this lovely Thursday afternoon? Has it rained today and it's actually quite warm? A little bit cloudy, a little bit overcast, but there is still plenty of blue sky interspersed between the clouds. So it's all good. It's, it's a good day. Right, so on this lovely Thursday afternoon, I have got my treasure chest box. Let's find the right way for it. My treasure chest box. There we go. <laughs> so there we go. My treasure chest box, which is a hair subscription box. So it comes out every month. It costs £25 plus £3.95, I think it is, postage and packaging. It's about £28 altogether. Box comes out every month, delivered straight to your home, and it contains everything you need for a wash day. So we're talking about usually a shampoo, cleanser of some sort, usually some form of a conditioner. There may be a styling product in there as well. Um, and then there might be another fourth product. But there's going to be at least four items in there, at least four full-size items in there, enough for you to do a wash day. A wash day, I should say. The um, products are suitable for people with, um, I would say, textured, curly, coily, kinky hair. Um, typically, people with sort of like black Afro-Caribbean hair people with mixed heritage so may have sort of black in their bloodline at some point but it's, it's what they call the type 3 type 4 hair I really hate using those but then I say that people know what I'm talking about um, but it's, it's again people with like very curly coily kinky textured hair so my hair is typically coily kinky hair and my, they classify my hair type as type 4 yeah, so you kind of get the style of hair we're talking about here. It's hair that needs a lot of hydration and a lot of moisturisation. Whereas what they'd call type 1 hair, type 2 hair, so typically what we call Caucasian hair, so sort of straight hair, doesn't need that extra oils and stuff because it makes the hair look oily, greasy and lank. Yeah, so you know, our hair needs that extra oil and moisture. The other type of hair does not. Yeah, so does that make sense? Okay, um, forgive me for filming using my mobile. I have no idea where my camera is. I saw my camera this morning. I know I saw my camera this morning and I know I put it on charge this morning. Went to just pick it up off my charge just now. And it's like, it's not there. The cable is just there. So there's the camera. I have no idea where the camera is. So I'm just using my mobile phone. The only problem is when I use my mobile phone, I never know where to look on the phone because the camera is either this end or it's this end. I think it's actually this end. But what I want to do is look straight at the camera, which is there. So it looks like I am looking at a slightly bent angle. So forgive me if it looks like I'm not looking directly at you. It's because I'm just used to looking straight at a camera. So it makes it look like I'm looking at a slight angle and I'm not looking directly at you. Yeah. It is what it is. Okay, so I would normally sort of do a quick review of the products I've done, I received in a previous month. And so in, uh, where are we now? We're in April. So in March, we, our box con uh, contained four, four products. The main brand of attention, in my opinion, was a brand called Bread. It's a, it's a brand that I've really enjoyed um, in the past because I've received the deep hair conditioning um, from um, my American beauty boxes. So it's like bread, deep hair conditioning. I'll try and put a photograph of it up here, but I might not be able to because that's another thing. Every time I use my mobile and I try to put photographs in, the photographs always come out not quite right. They always seem to sort of sit different. Well, they sit weird so some of my photographs seem to always miss the top or the miss the bottom it's all very weird that's why i don't like using my mobile to to film i am not a techie person i don't quite get it <laughs> i don't know how people can film brilliant videos from their mobile phone i just can't do it i need to use my camera and my laptop and i'm happy with that so yeah so in last month's box I digress again. We got um, um, the bread shampoo, which goes with the conditioner. We didn't get a conditioner in the box. 
the conditioner we got was from a brand called Bleach London, which is a brand my daughter has used before. And when she saw it, she just nabbed it straight away. So I actually don't know how good the um, conditioner is for my type hair. So they're yeah, very curly, coily, kinky type four hair. Um, my daughter's got type three hair. Um, she really likes it. She And I know it smells really nice because I've smelt it. it. It does smell really nice. I, I, I just don't know how deeply conditioning it is, but it's definitely a conditioner my daughter likes a lot. She has, she's used it all up already. It doesn't take much for my daughter to use um, conditioner. I go through conditioners like crazy in this household. So that has been used. We also got last month, you know, I can't remember. We also got a, a little oil, a, like a multi-use oil from the bread range. Um, again, I haven't used that. My daughter took that. So uh, the only thing I managed to get was the was a shampoo, which I was more than happy to receive. And I have used it with the conditioner, which I've already got. And they're just they're lovely they're lovely they're lovely they're lovely just really really good quality products and there was a fourth product in the box and i can't remember what it was i think it was from bread as well but what was it i can't remember was it a leave-in i think it might have been a leave-in conditioner from bread because it was three products from bread and i can't remember what the third product was but i know i can't remember what it is that means i haven't used it yet um but yeah i've used the shampoo um I used a shampoo, which was great. My daughter's used the conditioner, the Bleach London conditioner, and she's used the oil. And I know she's been happy with both of those products. So all good. Right, let's look and see what we've got in here for April. So let's do this quickly. Um, and then I'm going to run to the chemist, then come back and cook dinner. Okay, so this is what the box looks like when you open it up yeah so it says here sis cancel your plans it's wash day so yeah wash day usually means right it's basically taking out a day to wash our hair because it usually is a whole big thing to to wash this type of hair and we've got a picture here someone we've got a twist out and the it says on the back here product discovery made simple we do the hard work for you product discovery made simple um and scan the qr code can't do that because i'm using my phone at the moment so i'm just gonna have to go by what i know about the product if i know anything about it at all okay right so let's open this up and see what brand we've got this month we have oh okay it's a brand i like it yeah it's a brand i like yeah it's, yeah this is definitely a brand i do like so it's the cream of nature cream of nature have got loads of different um um lines within their company range they do very much cater for type 3 type 4 hair this particular line which is what i'm seeing i don't know if you can see it um, I can see the argan oil light and I really like that. I really like the leave-in conditioner, which is it's one of those leave-in conditioner sprays that I buy a lot. So we'll see what we've got here and we'll go with it. So the first thing I'm pulling out is the um, so Cream of Nature Certified Natural Argan Oil for Morocco Strength and Shine Leave-In Conditioner. The spray looks different or is it because it's in a different bottle? I don't know. I, I know it looks different. I just can't think what it is. It's either the bottle's different or the product looks different. One of the two. But I know I have used this leave-in conditioner before and I really like it. So something looks different about it. But yeah, I'm more than happy about that because this is a good product. Bit annoying because I, I don't know why I did it. Um, My daughter's been using the As I Am uh, Restore and Rebalance um. I think it's restoring rebalance rice spray moisturizer quite a big bottle and she's really enjoyed using that but i and i was looking in my supplies and i have no leaving sprays left that's how much we go through so i literally went on amazon yesterday and bought two bottles i know i bought two bottles um and they came this morning and and look i've got another one here so at least i'm not going to be short <laughs> I'm not going to be short, oh dear. And I also know I went on to look fantastic and bought the Sheer Moisture one as well. The um, Manuka Honey and I can't remember what it is, Black Castor Oil one as well. So I'm going to have about, I'm going to have five leave-in conditioning sprays. Well, this will be all right for the next three months, eh? 
<laughs> that's my way of looking at it. I don't know. All right, so that's the first product. Next from the same range is from Cream of Nature, and it's the Argan Oil from Morocco Heat Protector Smooth and Shine Polisher. Okay, um, this probably won't be used very often because we try as much as possible not to use heat on our hair. Um, but when I do use it, we do go through the product. So probably the next time I'll be using it, I'll probably be using it next week because I've decided I'm going to go to my interview next week. I am going to blow dry my hair out straight. So I'll probably use this for that. Um, that's what I'm going to do. So, yep. So we got that. I'll be looking very traditional and very middle-aged and, yeah, just middle-aged and conform conforming right next is from this brand so we've had this brand before vatica where we got in the box which was a box a couple of months back which had a load of good products in there we had an oil from this brand um so this is the vatica multivitamin hot oil hair mask oh this sounds good oh this sounds really good damage repair oh this sounds lovely so it's probably something I will definitely be using after um, I, <laughs> after I've sort of blown dry my hair out and straightened it and all of that, straightened it, straightened the life out of it. So yeah, I will definitely be using that. I'm just looking at the date on the back of this. It says manufa oh, manufacturer date is 05 2023. I thought it was like date should be used by. So the manufacturing date. So it was only made last year. So that's good. And this will last a good few years. But this sounds interesting. It's um it's egg protein. So it's going to be like an, um, an egg mayonnaise mask. Hot oil hair mask. Um, does it say what other ingredients are in there? Right. So have a look at the ingredients list. So it's got the usual alcohol, alcohol, alcohols. Alcohol, alcohol, perfumes. <laughs> I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing any of the good stuff. All at the moment, the first few ingredients have all been alcohol, 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 perfumes, some weird chemical. And then we're on the second line and it's got olive oil in there. It's got castor oil and it's got egg powder. Um, and it's got honey. So it's got all the pegs and stuff in there. So it's got some it's got some decent stuff in there. I'll be able to use it as a hot oil treatment. I mean, preferably, I must admit, I'd rather just use a hot oil. But what I might do, I'll, I'll use this and I'll probably pour some oil in there and use it. But again, this will get used up quickly because, again, hair in my family, we go through conditioner quickly. Give me a video when I don't drop something. I still haven't found that perfume from yesterday yet. I dropped something in every bloody video. It was so annoying. Right, what we got here? We've got an edge control. I don't use edge controls. Nobody uses edge controls in my family. Um, perfect edge, extra firm hold. I might just give it to well, my sister to use on Kayla's hair because she's getting older now. So she's at that stage when, you know, they want to do the little swoop and stuff in front of their hair. And she's got a whole lot of hair. So I'll give it to my sister to give to Kayla. Yeah, so same brand, Argan, um, the Cream of Nature Argan Oil. And then we've got Palmer's. So they're obviously we're looking for something to put in the box extra. And um, we've got the Cocoa Butter Shampoo. Um, and it's length retention. We've... I received this before. I think I received this in the first box I got from Treasure Tress when I came back to Treasure Tress. I'm sure we got the shampoo and the conditioner in that box, didn't we? Sure of it. Um, so, yeah, we got the shampoo again. Yeah, so they was obviously looking for something to bolster up the value of the box. So yeah, they just put this in. All of these products, every single one of these products are available in high streets now. Much more available. Definitely the Palmer's and the Argan Oil stuff. You can definitely get in at lots of high street shops now. Um, these kind of products I expect will probably be found more in sort of like ethnic hair dresser shops which you tend to find in the big cities rather than the high street shops like super drugs sainsbury's and so on but they are more easily available now um so yeah it, i mean it's a good box i think the product i'm most excited about to be honest is the leave-in conditioning spray and i'm willing to give this a go as well so these are two products i'm most interested in but you know what? I'm not complaining about this box. Products will get used. 
probably not this products will get used but i expect after last month's box which was like such a good box we probably did have to go down a, a little this month but hopefully next month's box will be really good again the May's box so nothing wrong with this box this is all good standard stuff things that are going to get used just not the most exciting but that's just my opinion all right okay guys i hope you enjoyed that video if you did please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed as yet give me a subscribe bang just like that yeah and i will see you soon and guess what the next video will definitely be an empties video i know i've been talking about it for god knows how long it's going to be an empties video and i'm probably going to have to do it in a couple of parts because i've got a lot of down here i really have so i've got to do it and the fact that i couldn't find that perfume i dropped yesterday it says to me i need to get rid of this stuff <laughs> make some space in my room all right guys take care have a great day and i'll see you soon take care bye